The following program is sponsored by The Greek, Ely's Radio Shack dealer, 570 Altman in downtown Ely, and brought to you as a public service by Georgetown Media in Ely, Nevada. Ely City Council Special Meeting, November 29, 2021. Good evening. I'd like to call our meeting to order. Can we please stand and say the Pledge I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. May we have roll call? Councilman Flangus? Here. Councilman Carson? Here. Councilman Spear? Here. Councilman Ulver? Present. Mayor Pro Tem Williams Harper? Here. Mayor Robertson is absent tonight. City Clerk Lee? Here. City Treasurer HR Director Trask? Here. City Public Works Supervisor Craig Craft? Here. And City Attorney Cook? Excuse me, folks, but your audio is muted in the uh, building. Thank you. Next is public comment. Comments not exceeding three minutes in length will be accepted from the general public in attendance. Are there any public comments this evening? Thank you, Madam Madam, on your agenda item 2 1, you're to consider to terminate all business business short line running the operating. They're operating on mile post 0 through 128 of the Nevada Northern Railway. How much have they paid to date for the track run? If they owe 1,000 or more, the city needs to impound any and all of their equipment that's located on the right of way until that debt is paid. The taxpayer has no idea. I want to remind you that the <coughs> excuse me. I want to remind you that the railroad needs to come back into the city oversight by the city council. The management board is mismanaging the railroad. They don't operate under the Nevada Open Meeting Law. The public has no idea how their money is spent. <coughs> Track rental has not been collected in the county for, I don't know how many years, 20, 15? We don't know. They have an obligation. They took a fiduciary responsibility, yet we don't know if they're being held accountable. Oh, uh, let's see. If they can't be accounted, the money hasn't been collected, that board needs to be removed from malfeasance. I have yet to receive an answer regarding uh, the rumored investment of tens of thousands of dollars from that facility. We need to answer those questions. Madam Pro Tem, on your agenda item 3 2, you're to consider the appointment of a council member with the Mayor Pro Tem to make litigation decisions. No disrespect to you, Madam Pro Tem. You've only been here a short time. This point needs to be a council person with greater time on the council. Uh, again, no, no offense, but we need somebody who's been here and is familiar with the, the uh, situation for a longer period of time. Madam uh, Pro Tem, the Nevada NDOT project directed a fence around the creek in uh, Central Lady, and they used barbed wire which is a violation of city code. The state needs to be put on notice before someone was hurt. Who gave them the permit and approved the installation of the city right away? Other than recently in the legals of the newspaper dated November 19, 2021, that uh, <coughs> Mayor Robertson was a contract administrator for the railroad. Madam Pro Tem, it appears that he's messing up and he needs to be corrected. Barbed wire within the city limits. Very cool. Madam Pro Tem, uh, at 745 uh, Great Basin Boulevard, the leak was taken care of at that property by uh, my brother. That was caused by vibration in the uh, QMD parking on top of the uh, water shut off. I want that rectified. Madam Mayor, uh, again, I'm requesting a complete list of properties and individuals that the city is permitted to do it. Thank you, Mr. Chief. <coughs> Thank you very much. 